Welcome to my space and energy. I'm Angela and this is La Luna Ray. Today I am making a Samhain Crossing the Veil Spirit Candle. During Samhain, the veil is very thin and we are closer to the spirit realm, making it easier for us to connect with our loved ones that have passed on and easier to connect with our spirit guides. This candle can help us connect with those energies that stay with us because they love us and have our highest and greatest good at heart. Using this candle will make hearing their messages easier. This candle will also offer protection from lower vibrational energy that can come through easier during this time of year. That energy that doesn't have our highest and greatest good at heart this candle can help protect against that. I start my candles by blending my fragrance oils. I will be using oils and fragrances that enhance connecting with spirit but also provide protection. be using my Gemini full moon oil that I've created to help with connecting with spirit for its communication properties. I always look up the oils and fragrances that I want to use because I want to make sure that the properties of these oils and fragrances align with my intentions for my candle. The oils I have chosen include sage, blue lotus, apple, orchid, peony, palo santo, heather, rose, and of course, Gemini full moon oil that I created myself. I've also included tobacco oil, not for its scent, but as an offering to my ancestors. As I blend my oils, I purposefully use higher amounts of the fragrances I like so that my candle smells beautiful. about 50 mils of fragrance and essential oils to add to my candle. I use the double boiler method to melt my wax. Isn't my candle jar beautiful? Someone always asks, how much wax do I use? And I never really know. Um, I can tell you this time, I just used double the amount that fits inside my candle jar and that seemed to be a great estimate. So maybe try that. As my wax melts, I will be gathering all of my herbs. All of these herbs include properties to either provide protection, 
enhance spirit communication or enhance intuition. I love to use wooden wicks because I love that crackle sound as they burn. This is a sticky dot to put at the bottom of my candle jar so that my wooden wicks stay in place. be using color dye to change the candle to a light purple color. Blue here represents enhancing spirit communication. I'll also be adding a little pink, turning the candle into purple, which ultimately will represent enhancing intuition.
I've been checking the temperature of my wax and now is a good time to add my fragrance so that it completely binds to the wax, creating a high scent throw. help my little wicks stay straight by putting sticks on the side. I will be adding glitter to my candle wax to enhance its shine. Now I will not be pouring my wax all the way to the top of my candle because I will be adding crystals to the top of my candle. These purple aura bonded clear quartz points are perfect to add to candles. It enhances the properties of the candle of connecting with the spirit and just amplifies the intentions that I have already set into this candle. Here is my Samhain Crossing the Veil Spirit Candle. It smells just like Samhain, overripe fruits and flowers and Palo Santo. It's perfect. Thanks for watching.